Mike with Mountain Mike Tree Productions. Today I want to talk about antler circumference versus or correlation with the pedicle circumference. Um, our deer antlers, for instance, um, we say anything over five inch circumference at the C1 measurement goes on a large top section. On a, on a deer, a medium would be five inches and under would go on that in a, in a C1 measurement. Elk are even farther out of the realm. People think, well, Mike, I got this, I got this bull and man, it is no way his antlers are going to fit on your skull cap. Your skull cap's tiny compared to um, their circumference pedicles are tiny compared to mine. My bases are over 13 inches around. And I'm like, well, this one here has got over 12 inch bases. Okay, those are big burrs. Those are big. Now we look down to the pedicle circumference and we're like, wow, that's hard to believe. Especially the pedicles on this big bull. This big bull, his antler pedicle diameter is six and three quarters of an inch. Our top section for a large bull, let's measure the pedicle circumference on it. Eight inches. This bull, as massive as it would look and as small as these pedicles look, this is the right top section for this. If anything, this top section could handle bigger animals. Six and three quarters, eight. This will work beautifully on this, um, but we don't need to have a 12 inch circumference top section for a, for a skull. We get that with deer people, we get them with uh, um, elk people. It's just, um, the antlers, it's hard for us to understand that an antler of this magnitude to grow out of a pedicle this size, but it can and it does. So I, I wanted to show you guys that because like I said, I have people call me all the time saying, Mike, your large top section it's not even close. It's not going to work. Do you guys have a super large top section or an extra large top section? Because it's, it's not close. Yeah, it is. And it will work. On our deer, our large top sections, I put um, antlers of over seven inches at the C1 measurement, above the burr, below the eye guard, um, of over seven inches on our large deer top section, and they look fantastic. If you see a deer growing like that, turn his antler over for a shed or something. Turn him over and look at it. They're not that big. Um, so that's, that's my lesson for the day. Thank you very much.